All right, why not have some fun? So, our rabbits are outside. There's waffles. Oh, I hear a rabbit in here. Hi, baby. How are you? How you doing? Hi, Licorice. He's my button. My boy. He lets me pet him. He lets me pet him. He's okay with it. <laughs> Some of the rabbits don't like being petted. You can kind of see the scar on his nose from the fight he had with his dad months back. And he does have kind of a, a cloudy eye. Although we've tested him and pretty sure he can see out of it. He doesn't run into things. Hey, bun. He's wiping the human smell off. Over here, this loaf is dandelion. That's the mother. There's dandelion. Now, I intentionally don't mow this because the rabbits seem to really enjoy it. Not only that, the squirrels seem to enjoy it too. So, you know, there's that. Okay, now I'm into the tough to find rabbits. Nope, not in there. Yep, okay. Cinnabon spot is in this tree and you can't see her. She's, she's basically invisible and she won't come out. That's her spot. That's her favorite place to be in the world. So when I bring her outside, that's where she usually is. But I can call her and she won't come. Normally she does. And then behind here, I'm gonna have to move the cardboard. And there's Jet, just hanging out. So that's our yard of rabbits. Just I don't I don't I know I haven't done a video like this in a while for the channel. And after a night like tonight, where Dallas didn't have their their best game. It's nice to come out and hang out with rabbits. And while I've got your attention, I realized the other night that it was just silly how much the, the playoffs were affecting me emotionally and I've started to kind of emotionally detach from these playoffs with the idea that whatever's gonna happen is gonna happen and I just can't be upset about it or celebrate too much. Celebrating too much is just as bad. Hey, Licorice. He's getting fed up with being petted. He's kind of thinking about running off on me. Or he knows what time of day it is and he's worried I'm going to try to bring him in the house. That look is, you're not going to bring me in the house, are you? But they're sweet rabbits. They all basically get along. I, I say basically because there are exceptions. But they're all girls except him. So in general, female rabbits seem to get along better with female rabbits than males get along with males. Just throwing that out there, at least in our experience, um, the fights between Licorice and his father, who who sadly passed away a couple months ago, um, they weren't great. I had to go break them up a few times. He's so cute, and you'd be like, I can't believe that rabbit would fight, but you'd be surprised. And see, he's over-grooming his sister now. and Again, I think he's nervous. I'm going to bring him in the house. I just wanted to do a quick video, and just to say hey, Hope everybody has a good week and consider this like a palate cleanser. It's just a cute video with rabbits. And yes, we mowed the front lawn, we mowed the, the lawn around this area, but a lot of the yard is really rabbit dedicated now. So they're out here for the day. I've, I've seen people saying, oh, you have to worry about prey animals, and or not prey animals, uh, predators. Not really. Uh, the neighborhood we're in, we really don't get like coyotes or anything. There's an owl, but it's a tiny owl. If it tried to pick up any of our rabbits, I think it would hurt its back. So yeah, we're, we're in pretty good shape here and we don't have like eagles and hawks out in this part of the Fraser Valley. So yeah, see now he's, now he's eating some grass and they really like laying in the long grass. So at any rate, there you go. I hope you're having a good week and uh, take care. I'll talk to you again soon.